39 right now. Baltimore City Health Department is partnering with city schools now to get as many students vaccinated as possible before school starts up again in the fall. WMR2 News' Aaron McPherson is live this morning along North Avenue with more for what's next in that plan. Aaron. Good morning, Christian. Well, it's really a three step approach, letting parents know about it, figuring out where those clinics can be, setting them up and then also helping to spread the word. Now, if you are a parent of a student in the Baltimore City Public School System, you should expect a letter in the mail soon from the school district and the city health department outlining their plan. In a few weeks, a survey will be going out to determine who wants the vaccine and where outreach is needed most. They're also starting an ambassador program where parents and guardians will help tell other, others about the importance of this vaccine. Then the health department and school district will work together to get clinics set up in schools so students can get vaccinated. Well, I don't really like shots, but I'm excited. I jumped as quickly as I could to get him in because I just felt like it was important for him as a as an individual, as a family member, as a community member. Pfizer is the only vaccine now available for people as young as 12 years old. The age was lowered after health officials say their clinical trials for kids were 100% effective, just like with adults. Now for Moderna or Johnson & Johnson, you must be at least 18 years old to receive that vaccine. Now we saw some of these clinics for teens 12 to 15 in Baltimore County, and now we're expected to see them here in the city, possibly by midsummer. Reporting live, Aaron McPherson, WMAR 2 News.